Hey there y'all, welcome back to Homemade Collectibles channel with a preview of a brand new homemade item. This is the Jurassic Park Kenner inspired Series 2 Utoraptor Reaper action figure. Um, this is inspired by the 1994 uh, Kenner Utoraptor action figure and you can see it, it, it's packaging. The packaging is inspired by the original Utoraptor uh, Series 2 Kenner figure, the Jurassic Park logo, the blue uh, background for the Series 2 Kenner figures, the trees in the back of the inside of the box. You can see even the way that um, the toy, the name of the toy is written down, is inspired be inspired by the original Kenner figure, electronic Utah Raptor Ripper, with screaming, no sounds, and claw slashing action. So it lets you know it's not actually electronic, but that's for the, you know, that's how the original figure was packaged and named. So uh, it's just like a recreation of that, uh, kind of like what Mattel is doing with the uh, Jurassic, uh, Jurassic World Reimagined line. Um, it does include capture gear. We actually, this figure does actually include capture gear, JP official, warning label. So we try to make this look as, as authentic to the original toy as possible. And you can see the dinosaur, uh, the Utah Raptor is packaged in. So this is what it looks like in the box. What's really cool about this is that it's uh, packaged uh, collector friendly so you can actually take this figure out um, simply by unsliding this and you can actually put it back in the box so it's collector friendly I'll go ahead and take it out of the box right now so that's all you got to do you take the box out of here this is what the box looks like without the figure Just get you a look at that one time try to get that original Kenner uh, packaging there so now let's uh, take a look at the dinosaur itself the Reaper Utah Raptor it's, I think it's actually Ripper I don't know why I'm saying Reaper it does include one capture gear piece um, this piece uh, real quick we'll show the capture gear before the dinosaur sorry so this is what it looks like. That's the capture gear, JP22. And it is a muzzle for the dinosaur. You can actually untab, uh, where, sorry. You can actually untab this with the black dot. That's right there. Just untab it. Same thing on the other side. And yep, so that's what the piece looks like. And just untab that back in here. And you can fold it in. And same thing on the other side. Just want to fold it in so it stays in its place. So that's the capture gear. There's the dinosaur. You can close the mouth. Put the capture gear like so. And the action feature is when you pull the tail back and forward, the arms are going to strike forward and the bottom jaw is going to lunge out. So make sure the camera sees it. So that it's now restrained from the capture gear. And, hold on, sorry. Utah Raptor is, uh, come on, ready to strike. And pull the arms, or pull the tail, and then the arms will spring forward and back. And then the jaw will also spring forward. Um, so if you put the muzzle in the dinosaur, you pull the tail forward and back, it releases from the capture gear. So, yeah. Pretty cool action feature. 
Let's take a look at the dinosaur and its details. Oops, come on. So, close look at the figure. There's the head. We tried to give it that exact deco of the original Kenner Utah Raptor toy. Even the way the arms are really um, extended like the original toy. Even the way the feet is. And it's also got those giant um, toe claws and the sickle claw, which is actually posable. You can see the back of the tail. See the detail on the inside of the mouth. You can see the gums. Bottom of the figure. Top of the figure. So I'm gonna put the camera down real quick. So yeah, the sickle claws are posable. You can move those sickle claws just like the original toy. It does have that bottom leg piece right there, just like the original toy. It's got those giant arms which are posable. So you can still utilize the action feature and the arms are still posable. So I can't even see it. So I gotta kind of like that. The arms are posable. The legs are posable. The sickle claw is posable on each foot. The jaw is on a fixed position, but you can close the mouth. You can't even see it, my bad. You can close the mouth for the muzzle to go in, so yeah. Do a proper review, but this is just a little preview of the figure. Um, so yeah, this is available for only $16.99 free shipping. That's all the asking prices for this. If you are interested to purchase one for yourselves, uh, there is a link below if you have any questions about this figure. Any uh, comments, just comment down below. This is YouTube. Um, let me know what you think of this custom homemade figure. Check out the link um, in, uh, below to um, see more pictures of this and also a detailed description. And if you're interested to buy it, only $16.99. That's all we're asking. Prices do change, but it's not that expensive. Um, inflation is a key factor in the affordability of this and also because this isn't like a plastic figure but it is safe to play with I'm not gonna break it let's see i'm dropping it I'm made with care so i'm dropping it like that aggressively to show you that it's not fragile but it's not not a toy not a toy for kids it's a collector's piece for the original Utah Raptor or you just want a really cool custom unique piece um, this is pretty cool um, it is kind of like a mixture of the original Kenner figures um, since it is inspired by it but also it's got its own unique design to it so thanks for watching have a good one thank you for watching